it's Bobby from Bobby's Cozy Kitchen again, and I have a guest in the kitchen. Hi. My daughter, Jessie, <laughs> that I talk about all the time, so say hi, Jessie, Betty. Hello. <laughs> so, um, I didn't vlog yesterday. I keep saying I'm going to be really good, and I'm going to do every day, but, and don't look at the computer, Bobby, look at the camera. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I was totally doing the same thing. <laughs> But, yeah, so yesterday, um, my son Seth and his fiance Heather came over, and she is, like, ready to pop pregnant, so we wanted to get together um, probably one last time before she has the baby, and barbecued and hung out for a while, so. I thought my fingers through today. I know. She's seeing the yeah. doctor today, so they're going to do, like, a little procedure. Why am I not, like, I'm happy. You got to do it. Okay. There you go. Oh, Remember, yeah. it's like a mirror. Okay. Um, <laughs> and stop looking at the computer. It's really hard. <laughs> anyway, she's having a procedure done, and hopefully, fingers crossed, that she's going to go into labor, yeah. and we're going to have a little baby here pretty soon. So I wanted Jesse to um, be on here with me to answer this next question, because I thought it was better to have a family member here. Actually, I wanted to have everybody do it, but that just doesn't work out to get us all in one place at one time very <laughs> oh, often. Yeah. That video would be so chaotic. Oh, good Lord. Yes. <laughs> it does need to happen. It will happen oh, someday. It will be interesting. <laughs> yeah, we'll be drinking involved. Yes. Oh, yeah. <laughs> so anyway, let's see. The question today is... Dun, ba, dun, ba, dun, dun. What dishes do your family and friends beg you to make for them? So, I will pose the question to you. <laughs> you answer the question. What dish do you beg me to make well, for you? Would, is it like something that I beg you or something that the whole family begs you to make? Well, no. I mean, it's like I know what the family, other people would request, but I want to hear what you would. Like if I said, I will make you whatever dish you want right now. Deconstructed chicken cord and blue sandwiches. Deconstructed chicken cord and blue sandwiches. <laughs> Which are on my blog right now with horribly like hideous photos. So oh, I, will, that's so good. I will be remaking them, but I oh my god, make them! I make will, them. I will. You make, will not regret it. Yeah. So, oh god. <laughs> it's so good. <laughs> yeah, I get that quite often. Anytime I say, "Oh, what should I chicken cordoba or a uh, deconstructed chicken cordoba blue sandwich?" <laughs> Okay, okay. So I will remake that. So that or your white chicken chili. White chicken chili. Okay, so Seth just requested that. Yeah. So, um. Because I'm going to make some food for the kids for after the baby's born. And I said, oh, you know, Heather really likes my spaghetti with meat sauce. Because she's requested that. And um, I can't remember it. Anyway, so I'm going to make some stuff for them to put in the freezer. Yeah. And he goes, um, Mom, can you make a white chicken chili? Because Heather's never had it. <laughs> I said, okay, it's not exactly chilly weather, but I'll make it. So, but the one that sticks out in my head the most, honestly, that I think is hilarious, is, um, now if I backtrack, and oh, I, go, I go back. I know exactly what she's going to say. <laughs> so you go back, <laughs> you go back before I started this whole blogging thing, when I was doing, like, the boxed meals and all that kind of stuff. And so, like, one of our go-to things was a box of Kraft macaroni and cheese and a can of Denison's chili. Oh, and my you God. throw it in a pot, and that's dinner. So... And the kids loved it. I mean, absolutely loved it. So when I started doing the food blogging thing, um, I started watching, well, I started watching Rachel Ray first and, you know, then got into the food blogging thing. But so I would start to do things like I was still sometimes making like hamburger helper <laughs> or, or this chili mac, right? But then I would like want to get kind of gourmetish with it. So, you know, I would do something and the kids referred to it as Rachel Raying it. So they were like, Mom, are you Rachel Raying the Chili Mac? <laughs> <laughs> so now I do it completely from scratch and, um, you know, make my own cheese sauce and all that kind of stuff. And the kids love it. But yeah, that is the thing that I get requested. And, and even after I started food blogging, they would be like, well, can you make it the old way? <laughs> No. I still do every once in a while. I'm like, oh, that sounds really good. <laughs> it's flashbacks of your childhood. Yeah. It's comfort food. But now I'm the one that's, like, making ramen all kinds of different ways, like sauteing actual garlic and, like... And putting it in your yeah. ramen. And I learned how to make yakisoba with ramen the other day. That was pretty cool. Oh, cool. Yeah. You have to show me how to do that. She got me to put peanut butter and sriracha oh, yes. in ramen noodles. And so that good. is, like, bomb-tastic. So good. It is so awesome. It is so awesome. 
So do we want to answer another question for today, or do we want to just, like, let's do another one. Okay. Because I think that that was yesterday's question, so we have another one. Okay, so you've just come home from a week away, an entire week without any home-cooked food. What's the first thing you make? Oh, my goodness. So many things. Well, The I first thing that popped into my head was ceviche, if you want to know. Really? Yeah. You would want me to make ceviche? Yeah. Oh, wow. my gosh. Your ceviche is so bomb. <laughs> so good. <laughs> Oh, wow, I can make yeah. that again. I haven't made that in a while. That was really good with the carne asada. Yeah, made, it was. Made surf, oh, my gosh. Surf and turf burritos. Oh, my God. Halibut ceviche and carne asada. Yeah. Hello. <laughs> but I was just thinking in my head, it's like, okay, I've been on vacation for a week. I haven't, you know, had any home-cooked food. I come home. The last thing I'm going to want to do is cook. Yeah. I well, will. it depends, though, because it's a... I don't know. Well, ceviche is not cooking, so I yeah, can deal with that's that. That's true. But I'm thinking like getting into the kitchen and a bunch of pots and pans and cooking. Yeah. I'd probably be, <laughs> I'd tell Kevin to grill. Yeah. I would be like, yeah, honey. Burgers. So we're home and, and I want food. Um, You want to grill? Yeah. Burgers, <laughs> for sure. Or even, um, he's gotten really good with chickens. Yeah? Yeah. Seth's chicken is so good, though. And I made blackberry barbecue sauce, which is oh. going to be on the blog. And it's really, it's not as good as her pumpkin barbecue sauce, but it's pretty damn close. Well, okay. Sorry. Good. I don't good. know if I can curse on this or not. <laughs> She's good. She's on the fence. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, so I was, like, really excited that she was going to be here today and be on the blog. Or on the blog. That is like such a weird blog. word. Blog. Video blog. Video, Video blog. blog. <laughs> <laughs> this is us all the time. So this is not for the camera at all. Yeah. <laughs> We're dorks, but hey. We're adorable dorks. Yeah. Okay. Um, but anyway, uh, oh, and the thing I was going to say when I was talking about the whole water thing. Yeah, so I got the little oh, knock yeah. on the door today that said, you don't spoil your water anymore. I'm like, yeah, I don't know. Yeah, because I was still kind of, like, sketched out about it, and it's not even where I live. Right, you were like, I was like, I could boil my water? I didn't even know that was a thing that could happen, and I'm, like, I'm at work, and my coworker's like, yeah, did you hear, like, there's, like, E. coli in the water, and I was like, gross, like. <laughs> yeah, thank you. <laughs> and, like, right after I went and got, like, a cup of water to drink while I was working, and he was, like, telling me this, and I'm like, well, I don't want this anymore. Like, <laughs> definitely want anything except water. Yeah. So now I'm like, I don't know. I don't know how I'm going to, if I'm going to, yeah. We'll see. Yeah. I'm like all nervous. Yeah. <laughs> how does it, I don't know. That's yeah, not mm, for the blog. No, no it's but. not. So <laughs> anyway, moving right along. Um, so, uh, oh God, I just forgot what I was going to say. Hello, ADD. Oh, look at the kitty. Wait. Um, oh, and I didn't get to show him the deer. I was oh. going to show him Louie was here. Yeah, Louie was here. Okay. So, um, yeah. Why don't you tell me? I want you guys to leave me comments. So why don't you tell me what is your favorite recipe or your most requested, like, recipe? Like, you know, if you cook for your family, what is the thing that they request the most? Or what would you, the recipe be that you would request? Because I really want to hear from you guys, and I want to hear what you think. So, um, that's it for today. And Thanks for having me on. Hopefully we'll see you again soon. Bye. <laughs>